Well, we are having our first official snowfall at the house. Mares are here. Piper's out. Oh, that's a training horse. Piper just knows how to make friends now, apparently. She's like, yeah, you and me, buddy. <laughs> it's been really warm lately, so she's Hasn't been wearing her little coat because of the temperatures have been so warm, but wake up today and there we go, we got snow. I got the other two fillies back in a pen because they're still confined. <sighs> I was waiting, I was on my way to work and my dad phoned to say don't come out for a few more hours because the uh, uh, machine operator is not caught up. So then I'm like, well, I'll keep working on the horse trailer because I don't have that thing put together yet. And of course, it's not just one simple thing that needs to be done. It's like incredibly difficult. I'm actually having a break from it right now. <laughs> not once did I say I knew what I was doing with repairing this horse trailer, but I'm trying to make it happen. And it's incredibly frustrating. Oh, but I need to put it together because I think we got to bring Johnny back up to the vet again. We are in the second week of his eye and uh, we're just struggling to get medication into his eye to the point where we're kind of just fighting with him. He's really, really tender about it. He's really unhappy about it. And we don't want him to be upset with us, you know, to the point where we're kind of losing his trust. But you can see that eye. That eye's looking. Yeah, he's like, no, don't look at my eye. Hi. I know. Oh, you're such a good boy. Hey, you're such a good boy. So it is, I don't know, leaking more than I care for. See all that down his face? <sighs> So I'm feeling the pressure to get this horse trailer put back together because we're going to have to bring him up to the clinic. And I'm feeling really inadequate on how to fix this thing. My dad was helping me put bearings in last night and then I had bought the wrong package so I had to go back last night and pick up a different set of bearings. <sighs> So we're going to pack those bearings today when I get out there to see him. But I need to take this off, which I did. I need to take the wiring. I have to disconnect it from here. And these little tiny screws are being a real pain in the butt. Because I feel like I need to take this off and then undo this to access the connectors in there. So that I could just nicely undo this and reconnect the new piece that I have. <sighs> yes. And it's, you can see us scraping it. So this is what I was taking a time out for because my fingers are cold <laughs> and I was being really annoyed by it. Okay. Anyways, that's where we're at. So that's how I don't even know what today is. Tuesday. That's how our Tuesday or Wednesday is looking like. Snowfall. I need to put all the hoses away. Buckets. Anything that we don't want lost in the snowfall. It's pretty. We're supposed to have snow in the forecast for the next 14 day trend. So we'll see how, uh, how much snow we actually get. Hey, right, anyways, I'm going to keep at this. Okay, so I haven't uh, videotaped a lot of it just because it's been hectic around here. There's Johnny. Hi, Johnny. Handsome boy. We went ahead and did the surgery. Uh, I think we're on day three now. Yeah, he's uh, looking good. He's perkier. He's happier. 
He's way more settled. Yes. He's not rubbing his bandage. We were being just hopeful that he wouldn't rub his bandage off on day one. Well, now we're on day three. He hasn't rubbed it yet. So what is doing that, that bulge there on the right, that's um, like a compression on his socket. So it's uh, putting pressure to where his eyeball was and just helping that healing by putting some compression and pressure on it. So the longer he can wear it, the faster he'll heal. Oh yeah, and look how perky and happy he is. Oh yes, just a happy, happy boy. <laughs> Very glad we went ahead and did the surgery. <clears throat> uh, the last few days going up to the surgery, he was just miserable and he was in so much pain and we just knew we weren't gonna save the eye. So the most humane thing to do was to take the eye out. I gotta fix this forelock, see how it goes in his one eye there. <laughs> I usually love, 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 love forelocks, but uh, when he only has one eye, I'm gonna fix that. <sighs> yeah, Ryder's happy. Ryder's really grateful that we did this for him. He really, really loves his horse. So yeah, there's Johnny. I will uh, show you guys what his one eye will look like when we take the bandaging off. I am just going to work right now. I'm working full time again. So my videos are sparse and in between. I'll do my best. We still don't have winter yet. It's still dry here. We had snow one day, it just kind of twinkled down and left a scuff and then disappeared. We don't even have snow on the hills. Our ski hills have snow, but not our close by hills. We're still dry, which I don't mind, but every year I know I say that and I'm just like, ugh, we need the snow pack. We need the moisture in the water. Right? Handsome boy? Right, Mr. Handsome boy? Yes, you happy boy? <laughs> Oh, let's fix your, there you go. And then it's not in your eye. I'll fix that. Okay, yeah, so much more content. Okay, anyways, I gotta get going to work.